अ कॉन्ट्रैक्टर एम्प्लॉयड थर्टी मेन टू डू अ पीस ऑफ वर्क इन थर्टी एट डेज आफ्टर ट्वेंटी फाइव डेज ही एम्प्लॉयड फाइव मेन मोर एंड द वर्क वॉज फिनिश्ड वन डे अर्लियर हाउ मेनी डेज ही वुड हैव बिन बिहाइंड इफ ही हैड नॉट एम्प्लॉयड एडिशनल मेन दो The question seems difficult, but the solution is very easy. What is saying in the question? Thirty men has employed by a contractor to finish a job in thirty-eight days, right? In the first case, the thirty men worked for twenty-five days, and after that, five more men has been employed. Now, the total number of workforce is thirty-five men. and they have finished the work one day prior to the scheduled time it means they have worked for another 12 days say so no so that 25 plus 12 that will come 37 days which is one day earlier than the 38 days now the question is asking that if the contractor has not employed five more men then how many days after the scheduled time that means after how many days of 30 days time period the work will be finished so in both of the cases this work will be the same i mean whether you are employing five more men or not employing five more men the work for 25 days will be remains the same so situation is very clear earlier in the first phase 35 men completing the rest of the job in 12 days right now the work force is 30 men and you have to find how many days is required to complete the job it's a very easy task forget this part i mean the first 25 days of work so what you will write 35 men into 12 days is equal to 30 men into let's say number of day is the so 6 into 5 And six is to two, and five is to seven. So total number of days will be required fourteen days. So in that case, total number of days will be twenty-five plus fourteen, and that implies thirty-nine days. So if the contractor will not employ five more men, the work will be completed in thirty-nine days, and the initial time period was thirty-eight days. So worker has to. work for one extra days to complete the work though the question is seem to be difficult but the solution is very easy just try to focus on the data which has been given in the question so thanks for watching the video